Yo, what's up guys, Castellan here, and welcome back to another video. So today, I've got another tutorial, and I'll be showing you how to do a laser effect, like this one over here. And it's a cool effect that EA have been using this year. So first of all, you need a template, or someone that has already a laser on it. You'll find someone on Google. I mean, I'll be using Cavani today. And you need your image, I've already got my image of it. So now, you... Get a cover on it, you use the pen tool and select around the laser itself. But when you start, start a bit further back, just keep selecting around it using the pen tool and then end it off a bit further back. And now you go to the brush and make the brush at an acceptable size you want your laser to be. And for this tutorial, I'll be using a size 6. Yep. And it has to be a soft brush so the hard to see on zero. And now you go back to the pen tool, you create a new layer. So you can put your layer here. And then you right click, click stroke path, make sure um the tool is brush and stimulate the pressure. Click OK and click enter. And now hide, you can hide Cavani or you can delete it, I'm just hiding it now. And now you've got the brush itself. I told you to make it go further back, so now I want to zoom out of it. You get an eraser tool, make it on a soft, make it soft and make the size pretty big. And just take the thing so it looks like it's fading away and do the same to the top over here. Okay, now I've done that, you can zoom in, and zoom in again. And as you can see over here, there's like these little circles for each corner. So we'll hide it now. We have to add it by doing this. You just to do this in the brush tool. Make it hard. Make the hardness fall, and make it a tiny bit bigger. Yeah, this will do. Now you just click. Maybe make it a little bit bigger. Now just click here. Do Click here. I'll become the last one. Okay, now I've done this, you can um, get back the it, the picture you're using and put the laser on top of it. And you can rename the laser as laser, so it can be easy to know. So now you can actually now you can resize it. So that is just the picture. And place it where you want to, you can rotate it as well if you want. Um, so I'm just going to make it a bit bigger. Or like this. I'll actually have it. First of all, you need to go to the layer style or the bending options and make sure it's white. I'm going to do it anyway. And add an outer glow. Yeah, I'll make it smaller. Maybe size 10. Maybe size 10 looks good. And as you yeah, use, you look at it. I really like blue. I'll just lower that opacity. It can be 75. We can just play around with the options, but okay. And now, we get the eraser tool again. Make it smaller. And make the hardness cool. Zoom in to where you're gonna remove the bit of the laser. So here I'll be removing on the head, so you just click over here and just click it around. There you go. And then you want it to go um behind the pair again. Okay, let's try it. So I show you. So they did the mini go behind, behind, then in front. So I go here. You make it behind. That's about right. And now you just leave it and go in front of them. And there you have the finished laser. You can. Because it doesn't show too much, you make the air go a bit darker. Yeah, that looks about right. And because 
Oh yeah, the laser, I like because that fades out because it was a bit big. You can make it bigger then. Make it make it a soft make it soft. Zoom out of it and it's like a safety thing, so it so can fade out. Maybe a quarter effect to have on the image. Uh, so there it is guys. So there it is guys, the finished laser. You can obviously like continue editing by doing whatever you want. And there you have it. Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you new. Comment on the you should do next and I'll see you guys later. Yeah.